You see the little shit going. That's a video. What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Iron Mike Tyson. Iron Mike Tyson says that he has a plan to come back to the sport of boxing, and he's been training. Wow. Um, he had this to say. He says he wants to come back to the sport. He wants to be in shape enough to uh, uh, train for some exhibitions, some three to four round exhibitions, make some money, help the homeless and some, you know, some drug effect affected people like himself, you know, come out of that. And, you know, he said he was very sore from, you know, hitting a bag, you know, he was hitting the mitts. So, you know, he's been training again. You know what I mean? He said, I've been working out a lot. I've been trying, I've been trying to get in the ring. I think I'm going to box some exhibitions and get in shape. I want to go to the gym and get in shape to be able to box, of course, the three or four round exhibitions, you know, and, you know, um, he says, also, he says, I do two hours of cardio. I do the bike and the treadmill for an hour. Then I do some light weights, 300, 250 reps. Then I start my day with the boxing thing and I go in there and hit the mitts, um, 30 minutes, 25 minutes starting in a, um, to start to get into a better condition. Um, I start, I'm starting to put those combinations together. I'm in pain. I feel like three guys kicked the shit out of me. <laughs> you know, it, it, it's, it's funny how, you know, the things that you speak versus how powerful your words are, you know, Yesterday, he was saying, hey, if I train for six weeks, I could beat Deontay Wilder now at my age. Not only did we, you know, we thought that was something that he was just, you know, theoretically, if he could do it, could it be possible? You know, like a what if, you know, it's a possibility, but actually he's been training. He's been putting in work. You know, he's been doing a lot of things that probably fighters don't do now. The only difference is Mike knew how to do it because that's when muscle memory comes in. Sure, his body is saying, no, what are you doing? Because he hasn't done it in so long, you know, but, you know, a lot of times your body needs rest, like the healthy type of rest you need for your body to heal. So it will be, it could be uh, healed enough to condition yourself back to that point. Probably not the way it was, obviously, but to a certain norm that can have you physically fit and prepared and conditioned to do certain things that you want to do. The good thing is he did it right when he, he knows how to do it and he's practiced doing it, staying in shape. You know what I mean? Because a lot of people that were in his uh, corner at the time knew how to train him, knew what to do, old school training. You know what I'm saying? You haven't heard of Mike Tyson on PEDS. You heard of him on drugs, but them ain't the type of drugs that benefit you in that sense. <laughs> but never, you know, the type that he tried to cut corners and training and such, you know. So Mike knows what to do. He's experienced. He was trained the right way. So he knows the things that he's doing. His, you know, his body's kicking his butt right now because he knows I haven't done this and went hard like this in a very long time. But it is good to see him getting in the ring and wanting to do exhibitions. I think it's healthy. Hell, if Floyd can do it and make millions, why can't Mike? Right? That's my counterpunch on it. Because even if he doesn't fight someone that's dangerous or, 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 or um, equal, right? Um, at least he can do something to exercise him, to give him something to do. And I think it's great exercise. The same way Tyson Fury goes into the gym and works out, come on, Paris, come on, you dulces, right? He does that for, he does that for, for um, medicine, you know, he, that's therapy for him. And I think Mike Tyson can do that. It would be a good hobby because it's something that he knows how to do. It's something that gave him life he enjoyed doing. And this is something that he would help other people. So he's not doing it for himself to make money and, you know, be the baddest man, and all that stuff. He's been there, done that and all this. But at this point of his life, in this chapter, I think he's returning to something that he once loved, but he's looking at it through another perspective because he's not doing it for the same reasons. 
You know what I mean? However, you depending on how these exhibitions go, if he is in there with people that's plumbers and, you know, and garbage man and, you know, have time, you know, uh, <laughs> you know, have time taxi drivers and stuff like that, you know, he may flatten these guys and he might want to challenge himself more. But I, again, that's up to Mike. If he wants to go to that level and do what it is, because he's already spoke something. Hey, I think I can whoop Deont Deontay Wilder to this day. So he might be able to, he might, he might try to do these things and see how it goes and see how he feels, you know, to get back in there and, you know, do his thing. And he, he might feel good about it. And if he does feel good about it, I feel that, you know, that could be the next step to do or to be, you know, um, move up a level. Step it up. Step up the opposition a little bit to see where you're at. Because, you know, you never know. And uh, shout out to um, someone left a comment on the uh, the Mike Tyson, uh, Deontay Wilder video. And they said this. I don't remember the name, but you know who you are. Um, said that Mike Tyson was the youngest heavyweight. You know, if he beats Wilder, you know, or someone that has a belt, he would be the oldest heavyweight. Wow. You know, so that would be like the alpha and omega, right? So that would be pretty uh, spectacular if he could do that. You know what I mean? But anyway, that's my take on it. You know, you guys tell me what you think about Mike Tyson returning to the ring of boxing. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched. Peace.